Hello, and welcome to Let's Play Endless Space with me, Zen Sander. Let's load our game, shall we? We're almost done with this, actually. So, the Zenoians were at turn 252. Actually, no, that's... That's not it, is it? Um... There we go, 224. Let's play episode 8. That's where we are. Let's load that one up. I'm sorry for last episode, but my mic should be working now, so... And we, we'll, we'll just be wrapping this game up. You just missed me terraforming for the sake of terraforming and pushing them around a little bit. So, uh, Some interesting battles, though. I had some close calls. Come on, load. Alright. Hmm. Alright, any, any auto battles? Probably. Um, yeah, this one. Uh, we'll just um, auto that one out. 10,000 versus 26,000. I'm pretty sure I will win. With 3872 HP loss. Trime's not building anything, but it probably doesn't have to. Yeah, I've terraformed it to Terran planets, you know? So, like I said, it, I had no reason to do any of this. But I just did. And I'm on a tech victory. Uh, three turns to tech victory, and I win the game. Um, I was just bored, and I was like, um, let's just get the tech victory. You research that, you win. The wonder victory is this one. Research that, and then build five of those, and you win. Or you've got this one at the far end. All it says is um, infinite rent, um, a positive income, just a fixed positive income. It's kind of cool. Um, negative 30% scientific victory research cost on Empire. So, um, yeah, if you code on this path first, and then that one, you know. But there's no real point. And look at this. I mean, 15% on Star System. And yeah, you just get tons of money. But uh, we're almost done with the game. <clears throat> Three turns. You get nothing to build. You know, um, I didn't. I didn't research any of the invasion preventions or stuff. But uh, uh, I just have some fleets going at it, and I got her. Her HIR. <laughs> okay. Um, since I have money, nothing to do it on. I'll just buy some improvement upgrades. Um, <clears throat> and food to industry, I can do that with the right text, so, yeah, influence is one turn, wow, without me even buying it, that's always cool, uh, this right here, you know, well, it's negative 20% ship cost on star system, that's always nice, and 100% surplus converted into industry, I mean, sure, why not, I'll buy it, you know, I just went from 22,000 to 109,000, oh, 122 to 109, yeah, uh, what is this? This is a tiny arid? It looks more like a jungle kind of planet. Anyway, um, I conquered them. They're doing finance, global tech, replication. I've already changed them out. Alright, um, how many fleets do I have here? More than enough. Uh, let's, I upgraded some fleets a little bit, but, um, let's see, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. We'll do that one instead. There we go. 16, 16, 17, 18, 11 of 19. Aha! Thought I forgot about you, didn't you? There you go, 15. Now I can put one more Yota there. Um, in both of these, actually. So. I wonder, I think her might be in my empire now. So. Uh oh. So it's probably best if I go to empire and. Um, see if I can upgrade my fleet. Wrong button. Sorry, wrong button. Um, retrofit. Yeah, retrofit. Yeah. I mean, of course. Um, it's costing me a fortune. I, I, yeah, a lot of money. But, you know what? It's cool. Because, <laughs> I've got nothing else to spend money on. I'm just rolling in the dough. Now my fleet should be much more powerful. Although, it doesn't really make a difference. Let's just send them all here. <laughs> Quite a few, actually. Hey, I've got an idea. <laughs> Let's attack you. Um, you guys don't stand a chance. Yeah, I lost zero hit points. And let's invade. Three turns. Yeah, there's a minimum amount of turns to conquer, and I think it's per planet. If there's three planets, minimum three turns, no matter how much invasion power you have. That's what I was mentioning last game. So, um... What are you guys doing? Are you conquering that? No. But you're making my life miserable. Um, uh, that's a fleet. It's a pretty good fleet, actually. Send it over. 
it's going through deep space. Because why not? And okay, it doesn't have a, an admiral, but it should be okay. There you go. And now I'll block you guys off from doing anything funky over in this system. And now he's attacking me somehow. Yeah, a little bit closer, but he still doesn't stand a chance. My attack is just better. Uh, yeah, 48 hit points lost. Yeah, I don't think you're gonna do much. Um, I have, I'm invading this system. This system, he should be off the face of the map in two turns, in nine turns, but I'd probably be well on my way to a technology victory, unless I just deselected it. And um, the options, I don't remember. It's been a while since I fixed those options. Okay, um, looks like I can fight, actually, so let's do that. It's a scout. There are scouts floating around my empire. Um, they're obviously wanting to offer peace. They're going to give me... Um, no thanks. No thanks. Yeah, they both want peace really bad. Um, 20 improvements. See all the terraforming I've been doing? <laughs> Got nothing else to do, so it's just like, sure, why not? Let's terraform. Um, eight turns. He's probably got some ships causing a little bit of havoc, like, somewhere in my empire. But he really can't do anything about me. So, I might as well just play this one out. I still have ships moving some somewhere, somehow. Um, I did that twice, for some reason. Um, one turn for Hadar. Hadar is mine. Um, and the moon survey didn't reveal anything, but it doesn't really matter what it reveals. Eight turns. Six planet system. Eight turns. Oh, just go to here. I wonder if I can drop it down to six. Three. You've been out that a while. Yeah. Um, Fifteen more system stuff. Um, a lot more planets are going to be idle. Uh, okay. I can't believe I still have ships moving. That's where do I have them? <laughs> um, not sure, but everything's so green. I love it. You, you, you're a dicky. Get out of. Get out. I'll take care of you. I'm just a giant. I mean, absolutely no one can possibly kill me. Uh, technology. You are victorious. Would you like to continue playing? Not really, no, because all I have is like five systems left to conquer in the game, and I'm done. So, let's quit the game. Um, this is really short. I started out neck and neck, and it just went from there. My score, 91,000. Um, fids. See, they show all the empires here, but when you get to the later options here, it only shows who was left. I don't like three systems, two systems. I don't like how this game is so polished, but at the end, there's no line graphs. You remember? in Civ or Masters of Orion 2 or whatever, or 3, where it had that graph which showed the progression. It, hell, Age of Empires 2, the Conquerors. You saw the graph. You were down here, they were up there. Then you watch your graph slowly come up, slowly take them out. It shows where there are major conflicts. Where is that here? You French people just dropped the bomb on that. But the game is fun. Anyway, this is all we got for this. Let's close this out. Um, yeah, see... Um, um, ending supremacy victory, I was just about there. Uh, get rid of him for uh, mili ranking and military power. Uh, research status, yeah, I had most of the research in the galaxy. Um, based on systems, mine, you know. Oh well. I'm sorry you guys missed the last hour and 40 minutes, but um, hey, what are we going to do, right? Uh, technical problems. Um, you, you, you fuck with a, a system option once, you forget to unfuck it, and then it fucks you back. So, <laughs> sorry. Um, I do like this game. Um, I do recommend just popping it in every once in a while. It's pretty cheap on Steam. And I, I think you can find it in the store, maybe. So, thanks for watching. I'm sorry this episode is short, but that's really the conclusion. Um, thanks for playing. Uh, playing. Thanks for watching.